we've seen a rise in demand for CLM from uh, human resources, procurement departments, real estate departments, and sometimes even sales. Do you think it was the cost effectiveness of having that in-house that drove this shift? Yes, I think it is. I think that's part of it. I think there's also, as we come out of COVID now or out of COVID, people are more dispersed. So trying to get teams to connect around a particular contract isn't like all turning up in a meeting room as it used to be. So you've got convenience, uh, you've got cost efficiency. You've also got the compression of time that it takes to conclude a contract. And even e-signature as well, no? So the way that we can compress it now is the con with the contract lifecycle is not only does it help with the drafting of the contract using AI, um, it then moves into the negotiation of the contract, particularly non-legal points, allowing teams across the business to feed in in real time. It then moves into the execution of the contract, so you're not sending couriers around yeah. the world like we did in the old days. 